These are eight tracks for people that have never seen them before. They used to be used in the car, but also I have a unit on there that I bought to play these. I used to listen to a lot of pop rock in those days, the rock music from the 70s up to 90s, around 35 years old. Started losing my hearing. At one point, it just went dead. This is the turntable, which is a technique. I used to see a lot of shows, and the hearing was good. I've seen Santana three times in my life. Bob Dylan, another one of my favorites. I used to love concerts where good rock music. And once the hearing started going, it just, uh, you lose interest in it. I became like secluded. He sort of, uh, it changes your life altogether. I was depending on everybody. <laughs> at one point I sat at the table and I was just looking at everybody and I just, I wouldn't say a word. And friends were writing notes. And that's when the audiologist suggested I go for a cochlear implant. At first I was sort of reluctant. All in all, it turned out to be fantastic. When they turned it on, I heard speech very well. I couldn't believe it. I was talking to my wife next to me and I was shocked. I went to see uh, Tears for Fears at Place des Arts. I couldn't believe the sound. I was like, I was actually dancing at my age. <laughs> it was phenomenal. It just, the, the two sounds, like, it blends, it's beautiful. But that really opened up my life. It's great to be alive again and be able to go to a concert and all the music that I missed out, the sounds that I missed out, that I'm enjoying now with the two implants. Like I say, it's changed my life, my life, music, everything, communication with people. It's fantastic. What can I tell you? At my age, I'm still rocking. <laughs>